Preview access provided by PlayStation. You're not helping! Are you kidding me, Connors? Hello, everyone, and welcome to Easy Allies Spider-Man 2 Preview. I just came, a couple hours ago, just came from a preview event in Los Angeles. Got to get my hands on Spider-Man 2. I played about... Two hours, I'd say. Okay. Played a good little chunk. Two hours, and I jumped in at around the five-hour mark of the game. Let's yes. dive right in. Okay. So I'm going to save. Uh, I'm going to try to hold the spoilers for the end because I know there's a lot of mm -hmm. sensitive viewers out there, especially when it comes to a hotly anticipated game yeah. like this. Of course. So this picks up uh, less than a year after Miles Morales and... Uh, again, we'll, we'll do the story stuff probably later on, so stay tuned for that. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll, I'll let, let you know before I get in any spoilery stuff. But uh, just basic premise is, you know, less than a year after Miles Morales. Um, Miles is graduating high school, and he's trying to do his college essays. You know, he's going through a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. In his personal life, and he's, like, using the Spider-Man persona to kind of just, like, not have to deal with it, you know? Sure, he just, yeah. like, leans into being Spider-Man, which I really like. And then Peter is with, you know, Aunt Peter and MJ, mm -hmm. and then you have Harry's back, who, Harry Osborn had a huge, mm -hmm. huge role in this game. And um, Peter, you know, I didn't see how, didn't see anything, but Peter now has the symbiote suit. Oh, okay. And uh, so, yeah, there's a lot of that, you know, yeah. punished Peter, which we saw from the, yeah, little, the gameplay. Little from, aggression. Yeah, that uh, that whole big gameplay sequence we saw mm -hmm. uh, a couple months ago, That I played that part. Okay. That whole thing. And then uh, some stuff before that as well. So let's get into it. Um, first thing was we played a six-week-old build, they said, and the game is about a month away. So mm -hmm. six-week-old build. It ran and looked perfect great i had to reload uh one time because my character wouldn't move you just standing there oh uh -huh. sure quick little reload mm -hmm. that was it that was the only problem um and we were doing fidelity mode they said performance okay. mode will be there when the game comes out mm -hmm. but fidelity, mode, off fidelity it looked great it was running great everything was great brad mm -hmm. as we have come to expect with sony first party mm -hmm. uh just ran like a dream uh, so the first order of business is just visuals and just swinging around the city. Yeah. It just looks How many more people are on this guy's list? Like, so much better, dude. Yes, because you just played the remastered version. Yes, played the remaster, uh, and then played a little Miles Morales last night to, oh, to okay, just get my prime. feet wet. Yeah, I was just like, dude, I'm, I gotta, I gotta dive back in. I was too hyped. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I gotta do this. So I've got a really fresh perspective on it. And... There's just more detail, mm -hmm. you know? It's, like, subtly better, but also significantly better looking. Mm -hmm. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, yeah, just just the the things I noticed were just, like, obviously, like, when the, the sunset is going off and just the city is, like, sparkling, it looks mm -hmm. so good. Mm -hmm. uh, the traffic was a big thing. Like, there's so much traffic on some streets. It was crazy. Just, yeah. like... You know, a line of like a hundred cars. I'm like, mm -hmm. this is crazy. I have a question. So mm -hmm. you, the first game is in Manhattan. Yeah. You know there's going to be like the outskirts, a little more like Queens yeah. and stuff. Did you like swing in between them and stuff like that? Yeah, dude. They're like, you can go across the water like really easily, <clears throat> Brad. It was like kind of weird. It was just like, I would like swing and like find these weird gravel points. I don't even know where. But then like, almost like he was like skiing on the water a little Whoa. bit. But then he would eventually like kind of sink. And then, but then you could like jump up from the water and then like swing again mm, okay so they make it really easy yeah. to swing across basically it's treated like a whole other island in addition to the original um does it load no no loads oh okay yeah, wow. yeah. uh when you go inside oh place, you know you go yeah. into a base it'll yeah, like yeah, cut okay. to black come in yeah 
but uh, the whole outside city, though. Wow. Yeah. So yeah, you have the whole Manhattan one, and then over here is like Queens and Brooklyn and mm-hmm. some other New York spots. I don't know. I've never been to New York really, mm-hmm. so you know, just the airport. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so I don't know what's going on. Uh, Got to ask Gabby about it. You yeah. know, the expert. Um, but one of the newest things is the gliding. Right. Yeah. Gliding. So I mean, y- you know how I feel about traversal in Spider-Man. Mm-hmm. I truly think it is one of the absolute best things in video games full stop call me hyperbolic whatever <laughs> i tr- i believe it mm-hmm. i truly believe it in my heart in my bones in my soul that traversal in these games is one of the greatest things in gaming and now it's even better mm-hmm. just like z- like zipping zipping right you're swinging you so now it's swing zip point boost Glide. Wow, a lot. Zip, boost, glide. Like adding the glide into the rotation mm-hmm. of swinging around is insane. Sweet. Uh, it's not really. Again, they, there was no like tutorial about it, Brad. Mm-hmm. So it was kind of just threw me in. But I, there was no like. You know how you do it in Arkham, where you do like the dive and then you do this. Yeah. Thing. It, it was basically it. just like, you know, you Explaining. you push triangle at any time when you're in the air, and it'll do it. Uh, but he will kind of like gradually kind of fall down a bit, but you have a ton of time in yeah. there. And then if you just like, you know, throw one swing in there, get back up, yeah, do it again. No problem. You can basically do like unlimited. Okay. Uh, when you scan, you can find like wind tunnels. Mm-hmm. That's when those rings will pop up. They're not always there unless you like scan. Uh, and you can find like little jet streams mm-hmm. and like really get a good boost going. Um, so in this game, you play as Miles and Peter. Yes. What's that like uh, when you're playing through the game? Can you yeah. freely switch between them? So one of the main missions I did, which was the one we saw, uh, what was right. it? Like Game Awards maybe? No, it was um, the showcase. The showcase, yeah. Um, that mission, you play as both. So like your mm, Miles does it and automatically. you switch to Peter. I, d- I got to do one main side quest and some of those side quests you have to switch. Okay. So it'll be like push square to switch to, you I know, see. I did one for Miles. But when you're just out in the world, can you yeah. freely swap? Yeah, you bring them? up your phone app or whatever and then you push of a button. Okay. Push that's a cool. button and then it swaps right over GTA style. Oh, okay. Yeah. So are they in like a different location yeah. often? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, like, Peter was doing something weird when I found him. He was just, like, not, you know, he was, like, zipping the line or mm-hmm. something. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so, traversal. One thing I regret, I didn't get to, I was looking, I didn't get, I didn't find it, I didn't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> the, um, this thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. I didn't know where the to do it. Thing. I didn't know where to do it. I didn't know how to do it. I Maybe didn't do didn't it, it once. I had it. I was in my oh. inventory, like, skill tree. Didn't do it, I'm sorry. So I can't comment on that. But yet again, adding more layers to traversal, mm-hmm. 10 out of 10. Mm-hmm. Um, combat? combat. Yes, yeah, combat. Yes. Let's talk about it. Yes. So I love the Spider-Man combat. Mm-hmm. I love it. I rank it a bit below the Arkham combat because... Mm-hmm. In, especially in base Spider-Man, just launching up, air air hit, and dodging, mm-hmm. uh, and, and just normal web shooter, meta, OP, 10 out of 10, it's all you need. Mm-hmm. You know, you eventually get into just such a rhythm of, like, you know, launch up, boom, because you get so much more power in the air, too, in the original. Like, you're, you're increasing your focus faster by hitting airborne enemies, so you're really encouraged to do that. Um, remember Web Blossom was OP, the like yeah, ultimate yeah. move, right? That, that was yeah. OP shit. Uh, um, and then just switching gadgets in one, you know, bring up the weapon wheel, kind of slows everything down. Mm-hmm. Just, you know, wh- when I go through one, it- it's basically, you know, air attacks, dodges, and normal web. That's it. Okay. So now, dude, okay, you've got <clears throat> your L1 mm-hmm. abilities. So you hold L1, any of the four buttons for. Peter, it was Venom abilities. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Like, symbiote Venom. And then Miles has the Venom electric yeah. thing as well. That's fun. Uh, you can have four of those. Okay. At any time. Cool. Those are on their separate cooldowns. You can swap those in for other ones when you level up. 
Uh, and then gadgets as well, Brad. You can have four of those equipped. That's R1 mm. and the face buttons. Okay. And oh, and then uh, just normal R1 is is that is normal web. So basically, you can have like five. Okay. So I was like, okay, amazing. Mm -hmm. So I'm really like busting all those out. Felt really nice. It was getting chaotic in the best way. Combat was so good, I immediately cranked it up to the hardest. Mm -hmm. They had spectacular. They didn't have ultimate available, but I did spectacular difficulty. Died sometimes. Cool. Because, Brad. Oh, God, that's so fucking good. It's so much okay. better than it was. Parries. Okay. okay. Parries, Brad. Parries. Parries are in some because, again, the dodge in Spider Man Original was so OP. You just mm -hmm. dodge everyone, man. Now there's undodgeable attacks. You uh, have to parry. Yeah. You have to parry him, and it is a quick little L1. Mm -hmm. If you don't do it in time, you'll take less damage than a normal full hit, but you won't, like, repost, yeah. stagger them. So there's, like, freakos with giant axes coming in. What, like, there was, like, a mini boss I fought. He had a full bear costume. Cool. Amazing. Beautiful Spider-Man quip of just, <laughs> like, he's like, uh, I want to tell you something. I'm out of honey. <laughs> it's yeah. just, like, hilarious. Yeah. Uh, so I was taking him on, pair, you know, he would do a whirlwind, I would parry it, attack, then all of a sudden he would start doing like two. Mm -hmm. So you'd have to parry, parry. parry. That's fun. Uh, there's other guys with like dual blades coming in. They do a big slam down. You've got to parry that. So now having to parry and dodge mm -hmm. and just having all those abilities on the buttons, like big step yeah. up. Big step That's up. good. Yeah. Um, what did you see about like side objectives or any of those around? Yes. So I got to do one main side mission. That was as Miles. It was uh, one about his school. It was really funny. It was actually the first thing I freaking did, Brad. Laser puzzles. Oh, God. The very first thing <laughs> I did in Spider-Man 2 was laser puzzles, okay. dude. But they were good. Okay. So like minor one side mission. Spoiler. Very vague promise the uh arrival school takes something mm -hmm. from mile school and you have to go find it and get it back so basically you're like following these clues because mm -hmm. they leave clues okay you go to one location and you had to solve all these laser puzzles it's actually really fun brad because it was like you have to to bounce them all around and it's just like okay really simple like i'm gonna move you know l1 r1 like move the 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 mirror mm -hmm. so the mirror would swap and you just line everything up Okay. Really simple, even for me, with yeah. laser puzzles. Uh, that was a really good one. Um, and then uh, I didn't do any other full side missions, but I did side content. Yeah. For example, uh, there are spider bots hidden around. Okay. Uh, collecting those. There were animatronic, like, falcon enemies, and you would have to chase them down... Uh, with the windsuit, mm -hmm. and you would have to draft them, like be in their slipstream, cool. and you, and it, a meter goes up. Like you have to be it behind them for a long enough time. They were so fun. Okay, you were just like zipping behind yeah, them, dude, through fun. the city. It was really fun. Uh, and then I did some crimes in progress. Oh, <laughs> you remember, boy, you remember those yeah. crimes oh, in progress? Sure do. So many. Thankfully, crimes in progress were not listed as a borough objective. Okay. So you don't have to do those for 100% completion. It seems More like crimes. More if you want to. Yeah, it seems like you were just getting XP and tokens. There's the token economy where you can upgrade your suits, uh, gadgets, um, and then XP is for your skills. There's three skill trees, one for Peter, one for Miles, and then one for both of them. Oh, okay. Um, they said there's like over 60 suits. Wow. And over 200 variations because now each suit you can unlock additional variations of a suit. So, for example, cool. you you have the main uh, Spider-Man one, mm -hmm. and then if you unlock the variants, it gives you four different color palettes of that one. Okay. Not all of them had color palettes. Uh, for example, like the norm, the one we've seen, the Venom symbiote one. Yeah, just of course had nothing, uh, but other ones did, and and yeah, tons of tons of suits. Good. One of the coolest things about side quests now, Brad. I loved this. So much. Not on the map at first. You have to find them. You have to stumble upon mm -hmm. them. Uh, or you can use the app, I think, and it'll take you maybe to a side quest. Okay. But there were a lot of things when you would just use your detective vision scan and you would kind of see like 
some activity. some AR glowing thing, and you would go over, and then it would be like, oh, you discovered a photo op. Remember the photo ops? Yeah. Take a picture. And then once you discover it, it will stay on your map. Okay. So you don't have to like do it right away. You know, you just discover it, then it'll pop up on your map. And uh, even when you have your map open, it'll be like, you know, you've done zero of one photo ops in this region. So you're still yeah, like that's convenient. completing, you know. Yeah. Just like, yeah, the burrows and whatnot. Yeah. Love that stuff. Um, okay. And then now we're going to get into kind of the uh, the final mission here I did because I, I did the one that we saw at the showcase but the end of that because mm-hmm. remember like Peter flies off mm-hmm. so okay so this mission was really cool because you are looking for Connors Dr. Connors my, such minor spoilers but I'm just throwing it out there so minor you're looking for Connors because Connors maybe has the key to helping Osborne Harry Osborne okay because remember in the very first game, Harry's sick, mm-hmm. you know, trying to cure Harry from his illness. So you start out as Miles, you go to this place, and then like Peter shows up, and it's like friggin' punished Peter. As we know, he's getting kind of edgy. He's ready to smash some faces. Kind of has that like, yeah, you know, that, kinda, that Batman little yeah. bit. Yeah. Um, so it's a cool mission. There's some stealth. The stealth bread. Now you can... You can just put webs anywhere. Okay. Just a, a, like a like a tightrope line, you mm-hmm. know, and and then you can you can put those basically anywhere. You could have like four or five of those up at once. Okay. So like there was an enemy over there, I would like put one up, go over, put another one up, and then all of a sudden I'm right above the enemy. So like stealth, just more layers, more right. depth. So even better than it was before because I love the stealth, like love, love, love stealth in Spider Man. Um, same kind of stuff though, you know, you would hit, you would shoot a little bin and then the enemies would go, huh? Yeah. <laughs> walk over to the bin and then you would, you know, same kind of thing. If you play the original is like spam your, you know, your detective vision, mm-hmm. then you'll know when it's safe or dangerous to web an enemy. You know, when it's safe, you know, you can love that animation. Yep, yep, it's so super awesome. good. Great animation. Um, so the boss fight. Yeah, talk gotta, to me about it. Gotta talk about this boss. All right, let's hear it. All right, so this this is definitely sensitive spoilers here because the full on boss fight before the boss fight though that um, my only where I was like yeah it's fine was uh, again the showcase level. Remember like the camera goes like Uncharted two style. You know, mm. you remember like those things where like Drake is running at the screen. Yeah, Mickey and Mania. Mickey Mania vibes, right? It had one of those, and it was like, yeah, this is fine. Sure, I get it. It's it it fine. Yeah, like if I had to nitpick about something, it just like had this weird like disconnect. I don't know, because that game like it's flawlessly like presented like between cutscenes and gameplay. Everything has like so much impact. It's so visceral. You're fighting. All of a sudden, it goes to a cutscene. They're doing things. Back to gameplay, but that that part like weirdly stuck out to me. It, it was just a little flat. Okay. So, but the boss fight. The boss fight. Who is it? Fucking lizard dude. Oh, cool. Connors, full killer croc, beast like. Rah! Awesome. You're fighting him in this big underground like sewer lab place, uh, big arena, and it is basically like a street fight, dude, mm-hmm. because. The, um, he would have this move where you had to dodge it. It would like turn blue. So couldn't parry that. So it was just getting down. Like he would come in, he would like try to bite you. You'd have to dodge it. Then maybe some like parry some other ones. So just like getting, oh, I gotta dodge it. You'd have to think on your feet really fast mm-hmm. of like, oh, dodge this one, parry this one. Um, just really beating him up using all my abilities like s- spamming them all just like freaking felt like clive out there dude. just like <laughs> cycling my icons dude yeah. i was like this one this one this one yeah. like so cool uh he would like run up on the ceiling and like start throwing things so just really really cool and then he like full on the last phase freaking like escapes into the city 
dude. Oh my, yeah, I'm sure it's crazy. Cr chasing him. Crazy, mm. dude. Just destruction everywhere. The cops are coming in. Third parties are coming in. Yeah. Just absolute anarchy. So electric. Uh, when you're fighting him, were both Spider-Mans fighting him at the same time? This was just... Just Peter? Peter for that one. Okay. Because he's like... You've done enough, Miles. Oh my God! I'm going. Yeah, okay. yeah. I have to okay. live a punish feeder. Dude. Okay. Um, got a little taste of Craven in the very beginning of the demo. Mm. Uh, just some really beautiful interiors, Brad. Like. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah yeah yeah. Just you know, beautiful like, interiors. Beautiful. Love it. You go to like Connor's house and cool. you can like investigate like some things in his house and like interact with cool little things there's Sick. like there's like a little keyboard thing you can mess around with like that's awesome yeah just top tier um i think that's pretty much it mm -hmm. i mean the skill tree seemed seemed cool you know you were just leveling up you know yeah standard stuff standard fare here uh there were some choices you would have to make for some of the skills so you would level up say like damage or something and it would be like okay your damage there'd be like a um you know one would be like all right 10 percent damage then another one would be 10 percent damage but then there's two things yeah but you can only have one it's like diablo yeah so you'd have to choose one so it'd mm. be like yeah some different effect yeah. on it it would something. be like you know you do more damage when enemies are airborne or you have shorter cooldowns or something mm -hmm. like that you'd have to choose one of them so okay. like okay this is neat this is cool yeah and then again remember the face buttons those can be swapped out so there's more than four mm -hmm. for sure I, I, I saw like at least six maybe at, wow so wow um yeah and then just yeah well sounds like it's pretty good it's I coming mean, along nicely it yeah. sounds like it's coming around it's coming around october 20th yeah it's looking real good I'm very pleased. Would I'm you say big... it's a PlayStation 5 showpiece? It is absolutely a showpiece. <laughs> okay. It is absolutely a showpiece. Because there was just so, like, it's just such a beautiful open world. Mm -hmm. Like, I know, I think people may nitpick it where it's like, oh, it doesn't look much better. But, like, I really, I really noticed it. I think it, I think it looked a lot better. Maybe when you're, better. like, playing it and actually moving through it. Yeah. Pe people notice it more. Like, there was a part when I was just perched on a on a building and I was looking down and there was, like, a red light and there was just, like, 50 cars lined up. Mm -hmm. I was like, dude, this is crazy. And then just, like, swinging down below, the, the you know, in the street, just, like, yeah. all the action going on. I went to Times Square. Sick. And, like, I was just there in Miles Morales. So it's like, I saw the difference I was like dude that looks a lot better mm -hmm. there's just more detail more color more everything so excellent spider-man yeah. 2 um very excited yeah very excited well we don't have to wait too much longer no so this is definitely one of the biggest releases of the year yeah and i'm very excited oh, and yeah. there will be more a lot more <laughs> spider-man 2 coverage as we approach mm -hmm the release we are easy allies if you like what you saw check us out on patreon.com slash easy allies or twitch.tv slash easy allies something's always going on here mm -hmm. we're always checking something out playing something reviewing something posting podcasts mm -hmm. all that good stuff so check it out and until next time love and respect nowhere to go Preview access provided by PlayStation.